Why buying a Nissan or Mazda brand car could be considered a good choice at the moment for several reasons, reflecting both the current automotive market trends and these brand specific advantages. Let's take a look. Hi, I'm Kevin Hunter, the homework guy, and right across the way is the amazing Elizabeth, the homework gal. Liz, you work every day with a ton of our channel members. What do you have to say about buyers considering either a Nissan or a Mazda right now? Well, first of all, let's take a look at the current inventory available at the top four Japanese brands. Right now, for comparison's sake, Toyota inventory is at 34 days. Honda is at 44 days, making both of the brands tougher to find good deals on right now. That's right. But no worries, because two great cars are right behind them. Mazda is sitting at 102 days of inventory and Nissan at 104 days. For both Nissan and Mazda, that means lots of good deals are available. So first up is Mazda, who has scored very high in reliability and has a lot of inventory right now, paving the way for some great deals. And Nissan also has very high inventory and they're doing very well. With regard to overall reliability, Mazda has even ranked number one ahead of Toyota for 2020. Admittedly, Nissan does have active recalls right now, but it's for limited years and mostly involves their backup cameras. In my opinion, that's a heck of a lot better than a recall for engine or transmission troubles. A backup camera is a relatively small inconvenience. All right, we'll get more out on Mazda soon in another show, but for now, let's get rolling on the top seven reasons to consider a Nissan car purchase right now. Number one, competitive pricing and value. Nissan often positions its vehicles with competitive pricing while still offering a range of features that buyers find attractive, such as advanced safety technology, comfort, and fuel efficiency. They are well below the $48,000 plus industry average. Yeah. Right now, CarGurus reports that the average price of a Nissan is actually under $20,000. This balance between cost and quality features can provide some good value for car buyers. Top selling models in the Nissan lineup have been the Rogue and the Altima. Number two, innovative technology. Nissan has been at the forefront of integrating innovative technology into its vehicles, including advancements in electric vehicles with the mm -hmm. Nissan Leaf, one of the world's best-selling EVs on the market. The brand's commitment to electrification and sustainable driving solutions may appeal to you environmentally conscious consumers. Number three, comprehensive warranty. Nissan vehicles typically come with a comprehensive warranty package, including limited vehicle coverage and powertrain coverage, which can provide peace of mind to new car buyers. Every new Nissan vehicle is protected by basic coverage bumper to bumper for three years or 36,000 miles and by powertrain coverage for five years or 60,000 miles, whichever comes first. Mm -hmm. However, a 2024 Nissan Titan right now comes with five years or 100,000 miles of basic coverage and matching powertrain coverage for five years or 100,000 miles. Make sure you check the warranty on the specific year and model that you're interested in. These warranties protect you from material and workmanship issues from the factory. Number four, improved models. Recent years have seen Nissan refresh and update many of its key models, improving design, technology, and performance to better compete in their segments. This makes newer Nissan models particularly attractive for those seeking the latest in automotive design and technology. Nissan's sedan lineup begins with the value-minded Versa and includes the compact Sentra and midsize Altima. Nissan also has two sports cars, the Z and the GTR. The full-size Titan and Titan XD pickup trucks are discontinued after the 2024 model year, but the mid-size Frontier continues to be built. Also, I must say with regard to reliability, we are reasonably impressed with the average annual repair cost to a Nissan consumer, with that spending sitting at $500 a year right now. That is quite low and fits into pretty much anyone's budget. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Number five, financing and incentives. With the auto industry constantly evolving, Nissan, like many manufacturers, often offers attractive financing rates, lease rates, and incentives to new car buyers. These offers can make purchasing a new Nissan more affordable in the short term. Right now, 0% financing is available on some models with 2.9 and 4.9 being available on others. Those are very attractive rates. That's right. Number six, fuel efficiency. Many Nissan models are designed with fuel efficiency in mind, which can lead to long-term savings on fuel cost, an important consideration given fluctuating fuel prices. Nissan Versa has generally been the most fuel efficient gas-powered Nissan model, returning up to 40 miles per gallon on the highway and 32 miles per gallon in city driving. The Nissan Altima miles per gallon ratings and Sentra fuel economy follow closely behind as both of these Nissan sedans can deliver up to 39 miles per gallon on the highway. That's very solid. Yes. And number seven, diverse lineup. Nissan's vehicle lineup is quite diverse, ranging from compact cars and sedans to SUVs and trucks 
not to mention their electric vehicles. This diversity ensures that potential buyers can likely find a Nissan vehicle that fits their needs and lifestyle. Nissan models are also largely manufactured in the USA. Almost a dozen Nissan models are built in the United States. These rides include the Altima, Murano, Rogue, Maxima, Leaf, Pathfinder, NV, Frontier, and Titan. In addition to these vehicles, some of Nissan's powertrains are manufactured in the USA as well. There's also market factors to consider. Depending on current economic conditions, such as interest rates and inflation and inventory levels especially, which we've already shared are above 100 days for Nissan, there might be additional market-driven reasons that make buying a Nissan more appealing at the moment. Before making a decision, it's crucial to consider the current market dynamics, Nissan's latest offerings, and how they align with your personal or family needs, budget, and long-term vehicle expectations. Always conduct the latest research and consider taking a test drive to ensure the vehicle meets your expectations. Also, I'd like to share a recent Nissan shopping experience by one of our viewers, Rose Harris. Rose wrote, My husband and I were recently shopping for a used SUV at CarMax when I noticed a similar SUV online at our local Nissan dealer. I called the dealer to see if the car was available at the price listed. I was told yes. My husband went to the dealer and test drove the SUV. The dealer beat our credit union's financing and we said no to all the add-ons. The next step was the finance guy. We said no to all the add-ons again. He printed our contract that included $1,191 of add-ons. Go we figure. Yeah. We refused to pay for those add-ons. We were told that we had signed something with the salesman agreeing to an optional protection plan. This plan included nitrogen in the tires, whoa, plastic strips on the doors, and a 12-month car theft plan. All junk. Mm, yeah, yeah. If they said if our car was stolen during the first 12 months of ownership and was determined to be unrecoverable, the dealer would cut us a check for $2,500. That'll never happen. No. I said, so you were trying to charge us an additional $1,200 for air. We refused and told him that we'd take our business to CarMax. We decided to leave after the guy left to talk to his manager again. He just kept repeating that it was already on the car. I told him it was a used car and that they should have already included air in the price. We were halfway home when the finance guy called us to come back. My husband didn't want to go back, but I was tired of shopping. The dealer had a 3.99% rate. Evidence, friends, that walking out definitely helped these guys. I love hearing that more and more of our viewers are pushing back on dealer nonsense and winning. Totally. Friends, maybe you're that type of person who readily admits that you kind of suck at standing up for yourself at car dealerships. If so, that's okay. If you missed our recent show where we announced a new addition to the homework guide team, Stuart Cooper, known as the Car Hagler, I want to remind you about that video. From start to finish, Stuart does it all for you. He negotiates your trade, negotiates the price of your new car, and gets rid of all the dealer nonsense. The service isn't free though. It starts with the $99 phone call with Kevin. And by the way, if Kevin determines you're not a good fit to work with Stuart, we just refund 100% of your money. It's that easy. Beyond that initial phone call for $99, assuming you're a good fit to work with Stuart, we'll send you an invoice for a $750 deposit. Most of that goes directly to Stuart. Once you have your car and assuming you're happy with the service, you'll also owe an additional $200 payable directly to Stuart. That brings your total cost of $1,050 well below the $1,500 charged by other content creators here on YouTube. Not only are we several hundred dollars cheaper, but you get three of us to work with, me, Liz, and Stuart. Yep. Our lineup of support is far more effective than any comparable service out there, and we guarantee you'll save thousands of dollars, many times more than what it costs to hire us to do this for you. Yes, we love working with you. In addition, you don't have to lift a finger. We do it all for you. No dealer negotiations to deal with, no lowball trade numbers to laugh at, no stupid dealer lines about forced add-ons or ridiculous fees. We pave the road for you. When the time comes, you just have to go in and sign for your car. And we coach you on exactly what you need to say when you visit the dealership. And for those of you who just need a little one-on-one -on -one coaching, we have several packages available for you. First, there's the Homework Guy Help Package, which is $24.99 for email support from Liz, turnaround time is less than 24 hours, and a $49.99 consults package, which is tech support with both me and Liz, turnaround time is the same day. Yes. And that is $49.99, also includes the email support too. Last of all is the $99 phone call directly with me, which is 45 minutes of my undivided time answering your questions and giving you everything you need to succeed. I typically schedule this call within 24 hours after it's paid. 
By the way, the 99 phone call with Kevin includes 30 days of text support with both Kevin and me and 30 days of email support with me afterwards. So the help just continues. As Kevin said, turnaround time is very fast on all of our services. Just don't have the audacity to complain 30 minutes later that you haven't heard from me yet. We're not bots. We're real people. We do have a life outside of this, you know. We do love working directly with our members and the reports of the great deals that you guys are sending us with our assistance are very inspiring. That's right. We greatly appreciate the opportunity to work with all of you. Thanks again to our many faithful followers who just keep coming back. And to all of our longtime subscribers out there, you guys rock. God bless you all. On behalf of the entire Homework Guy team and the amazing Elizabeth, I'm Kevin Hunter. Thanks for listening.